look back at the start of this race i swear i saw somebody jumping at the start of the race i think that probably threw dimitri off uh, i swear there would have been another disqualification but uh, we see the umpires uh, in a sort of a, a little a little panel discussion there trying to see if they went wrong but my gosh just three runners in that race it's the girls 100 meter finals into school 2015 and we're gonna focus in the center we've got washington archival high school in mills but uh look at this lady in uh, virtuals high she won the 200 meters on saturday but she was in the outer lane but i guess she came in with a nice time so she's in the center looking at virtuals and what she had to set and we got a clean start, so we're focused in the center of the track. We're looking at the young lady from Bocha. She's going very well. Look, the same one, Shanice Elliott from Bocha's eye. She did it yesterday. She come back today, and she's going to do it again. 100 meters, and another Bocha's athlete has pulled up. But uh, the glory goes to Bocha's high, and uh, Shanice Elliott taking it. But the other Bocha's athlete, she goes down in agonizing pain, just a couple meters away from the line but glory glory goes to virtual eye doing the back-to-back -back in the sprints i'm oh, sorry doing the double in the sprints winning the 200 and now winning the 100 meter finals under 18 boys finals in the school 2015 now we are looking at uh, farrell from charleston secondary um matthew who's in lane three from kayon won the 200 yesterday and then we also got to look at John from Washington Archibald High School. Those are the fastest qualifying times coming in. But you just never know. This is the finals. What's going to happen? Runners are down. After set. And we got a clean start. Like I said, we're looking in the center. Look at Keon already making a move. Keon already out in front. Oh my gosh, it's Matthew. A different race. He is just class among the race. And look at this. Look at this. Matthew doing it for Kayon, doing the 200 meters on Saturday, coming back on Sunday and winning the 100 meters, and officially the fastest young man in St. Kitts and Nevis, under 18. Well done. All right, well, it is the under 20 senior girls, 100 meters, and uh, looking at this one, it's going to be tense. Looking in the center, see a Charles emails. That's a set. Well, we got a clean set. Was expecting another gun, but nothing doing. This young lady from Charles emails came from behind yesterday to win the 200 meters. Well, she had the same girl from CNBC. Badly down right now, but she's only first. Only first and goes all the way. She did it in the 200 meters on Saturday. She came from behind, but this time around, she led all the way and took the 100 meters this time around. No come from behind victory. So congratulations to Charles E. Mills secondary. All right, well, this is it. The final set of 100 meters. And well, this is the senior boys under 20. The runners are down. That's a set. And well, we got a clean side looking at the center of the track. And they look like LK. He's out there. Is it? Is it? Yeah, he look like LK from uh, CFBC. He's in the race of his own. Look at this. Execute all the way. And it's CFBC. CFBC taking gold this time around. And so uh, LK, Alconis, Bridgewater uh, taking the gold for Clans Fitzroy Brand College.
Washington.